I know the light's bad, um, but I feel like I need to talk to you right now, <laughs> so I don't want to wait. Also, it's super rainy out today, which means that it's going to be gray all day, and then it probably won't yet, like, properly daylight most of the day today, so I just weighed myself, and yesterday I weighed at 208.2. And today I weighed at 206.6. So it's like six, it's like 1.2 that I lost. Um, good job. And I'm pretty excited that that. It's dirty and I need you to put water in it so I can not get dirty. <sighs> in the sink in the bathroom, honey. So the bathroom says it's not fit in the bathroom on the table. It'll fit. Look at it. Squishes down. Anyway, um, I'm pretty happy about that because I was worried that, that one day I didn't lose anything like yesterday. <laughs> and it's almost like you can actually feel yourself be smaller, which is the weirdest sensation. Like you feel like just more compact. And I think that when you lose weight traditionally, like the the less in more out way um it's so gradual i don't i never felt like that even though i i mean i lost 100 pounds so like i lost a lot of weight but um i never felt like like the next day i was like smaller and you know what i what i woke up this morning and i was thinking about that how like smaller i feel and i was like dude i wonder if the biggest losers contestants feel like this because you see those people in seven days they lose like 32 pounds like when they're their first like say the the second or third week they're they're they're, they're having like really big weight loss because they're still very large people and they're exercising very heavily so you know um they're burning a lot more calories than a thinner person would and they have these huge huge weight losses like some of these guys <laughs> And I wonder if they have similar sensation. Anyway, that's just my, my morning thought. I do have my bulletproof coffee, which is my sweet, sweet friend. I'm going to go now. I'm still a little tired and loopy. I think I've only been up like 15 minutes, like long enough for the coffee pot to finish. Because the coffee pot is automatic. It kicks off at a certain time. And, uh, it's dark. She's in there. She cracks me up, that kid. She says the most hilarious stuff. Uh, anyway, um, I'm gonna get some YouTube going and sit drink some coffee for a few minutes. Chris did make it home okay last night. He did not work, um, he just finished his regular shift. I think he got in at 7. Or six, something like that. I could check, but I know he was there by seven, and in and all that stuff. And he just worked till eleven. He just finished his regular shift. He actually had the whole day off, but he told them that he would probably come in because he did um, eight hours of overtime. He did four hours, like two twelve-hour shifts, where there's four extra hours on each. So. He had 40 hours with even without that if he would have taken the whole day off, but he got three or four hours in. Um, seven, eight, nine, ten, yeah, that's he did a half a shift and he had talked about staying till 3 a.m. because that's what his 12 hours is usually at the end of the shift, 3 a.m., working over in another department that needs like a lot of help. So, but he said last night he just he didn't, and I told him to not commit to that because he wanted to commit to it and I was like don't tell them that because if you tell them that then you have to do it you don't know what it's going to be like how tired you're going to be and stuff like that so um so we've got four hours of overtime this week which is not much but it's freaking great considering he like essentially had a day off you know what I'm saying so um I don't think he's getting any overtime today and I'm really okay with that he needs he needs a rest especially after that shenanigans with like going to 
like essentially it's like from here to Pittsburgh like it's just on the other side of Pittsburgh but if you were looking on a map if you're just curious like Akron to Pittsburgh it's like essentially like the the trip that he made there and back and then he went to work so oh dumb kids you know they watched that Nye and Ellie and it's been the funniest thing Evelyn looked at me the other night and she goes do you need to call five 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 dem bag kids they have like this bad babysitter and the phone number to call to get this babysitter is five 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 dem d-e-m b-a-d-k-i-d-s dem bag kids and I just think that's the funniest thing Gosh. ever good job Ev hey Ev who's your babysitter no what what phone number do we call to get the babysitter Five, 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 dem bag yeah, kids. Yeah. <laughs> it just is the funniest thing to me. So, oh, oh, watch my coffee. Oh, she found me. Say good morning. Good morning. Say good morning. <laughs> so, anyway, that was just my little morning update that I, I wanted to share with you. I just have a big diaper on. Yeah, it's time for you to take that nighttime underwear off, huh? I'm not showing the, your butt on camera. Even though it's in a diaper, I'm just not going to be showing that. Despite the fact that you want to show the world that. No, I watch Naya and Ellie on here. You do, yes. What, what's our favorite thing? Five, 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 dim bag kids. No, it's poop. It's poop? Yes. Poop emoji to you. Poop emoji to you. Say poop emoji to the to the, the subscribers. Poop emoji to you, camera. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, well I'm going to leave it on that note because I don't think it's going to get any better than that. <laughs> Lillian's like, yes, I'm here too. I am. I got a poop emoji yam. No, you don't. Yes, I do. <laughs> it's a poop emoji yam. She's wishing. Say bye. Bye bye, guys. Bye bye, guys. Boop. <laughs> All right, so it is almost 9 a.m. I just got the stuff cooked. I have my tray of chicken. This is a five piece chicken. This is a honey garlic chicken in there, ready to go so that it can go. It's crisis time. Okay, I just cleaned my phone off because I couldn't tell if my camera was dirty, if it was my screen over here was dirty, or what, or if my eyes were like, and or my glasses, so, gosh, I didn't clean my glasses, I should probably clean them, but it, clearly cleaning the phone is way better because everything looks much better. <clears throat> Doesn't look like I have Vaseline on the, on the lens, but, me, 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 me. no, I'm not putting those jammies on, you have clothes on. You need to finish your food at the table. We're going to brush your hair. Yeah. Anyway, so I feel like I'm getting some stuff kind of picked up. I did pick up the dining room. I tidied. That's what I did. I didn't. I literally cleaned nothing. I just picked up the trash, put it in the trash, put the toys in the toys, and the dirty clothes down the dirty clothes chute. That's tidying. That's all I did. It could stand a vacuum. Okay, so I do have this towel, which you can totally see. Uh, I could probably put this away to this ladder, but the kids have been playing on it. They really like it. So, oh, there's a towel. The kids put towels on the floor and put them out to dry. They're dry. They need to be put away. All right, I'm going to go do that right now. Because this is totally what this was built for. What are you doing there, Ev? Uh oh, bump. Bump. <laughs> you catching a ride, Lily? Yeah. Well, I'm glad that that's getting put to good use. Are you having fun? You're going to Walmart. Yay! Hold on, hold on. Uh, hold on. It's harder to get up the uh
harder to get up the lip than it is to come down for sure. Is that fun? Yeah. Oh. Man, it's like I, that camera turned around and I was like, oh my face. Like you can tell I'm like tired today. <sighs> Got the kids in their bath. You can see I have eyes on them. This is about as far away as I can get, but it's a very comfortable spot at the kitchen table. I see you. They're having a great time though. What? Camera, camera, say hi. Hi, hi, poop emoji, because that's the kind of, you know, chat that she wants to have. Anyway, um, I just wanted to let you know that I was super excited about the whole pound plus that I lost today. And also, I measured... That's not necessary, honey. There's nothing wrong with you. Um, but I also measured my waist, and I am two inches smaller around my waist. Like, wow. And essentially, that's since the 1st of May. I think I had like a half a day before that, maybe. But the 1st of May, isn't that mind-blowing? Mm -hmm. Sure is. I am just really worn out. I don't know that I'm going to be doing much else chatting with you. Although I have really enjoyed chatting with you today. I actually, I got up and I felt like vlogging, uh, you know, this morning. And I, obviously I did. I did two loads of laundry also this afternoon. I have them hanging out. I'm sure that I have a whole load already done and pulled in. But there's like t-shirts and t-shirts take forever to dry. Forever. Just watching them, making sure everything is copacetic. Um, but I got one, two, three, I got probably four t-shirts, my camo pants, you know, which will still fit, thankfully. Um, it's part of the reason I did laundry today. I think I did all that laundry the last, the other day I did like four or five loads and I was like, I want my camo pants. So I made sure they went in the first load. I still have a load of kids clothes. I'm just saying, when kids are potty training, good gravy, there is so much. You're going to the grocery store? There's just so much laundry involved with... Do not throw water out of the bathtub! I'm going to go 